again, John, something really that's always fascinated me is the working relationship between yourself and George Martin. Because you were talking earlier about wanting to be in control of things. And I get the feeling, really, that, that in terms of the working relationship, and you must tell me whether this is right or, or not, between you and George Martin worked in the sense that he was the technical advisor. And in a sense, the creative input, the musical input, came from the band. I mean, is that true? Yeah, it's hard to describe a relationship. You know, they either say George did, Martin did everything, or the Beatles did everything. It was neither one, you know. We both, George had done little of, uh, no rock and roll when we met him, and we'd never been in a studio, so we did a lot of learning together. He had a very great musical knowledge and background. So he could translate for us and suggest a lot of things, which he did, you know, and he'd come up with amazing technical things like slowing down the piano and playing it slow and putting it on and, and things like that, you know. Well, we'd be saying, well, can we, we're on it, go, ooh, and, and e, e, and he'd say, well, look, chaps, I thought of this this afternoon. Last night I was thinking, I was talking to uh, whoever he was talking, and I came up with this, you know, and we'd say, oh, great, great, <laughs> or put it on here, you know. And like in Walrus, when we made it, we had, on the mix of Walrus, we have a live radio coming through, mm. you know. So whatever came through on the radio was like, now if I just, I don't know where it came from, if I said I want the radio on it, George would make it so as I could mix and there, well, the radio would be coming through the machines, you know. But he also come up with things like, uh, well have you heard an oboe? Oh, which one's that? Is this one. Hey, that would be nice. Mm. You know, things like that. So it was really, we grew together. You know. Mm. And so it's like saying, it's, it's hard to say who did what, you know. Yeah. I mean, he taught us a lot, and I'm sure we taught him a lot by our, our sort of n primitive musical ability, which is all I have still, you know. I still have to have something to translate what I'm trying to say all the time. And so it was a mutual benefit, mm. society, whatever they call it.